se dovessi scegliere un esergo per il cinema d'animazione di Regina Pessoa io direi che fa venire alla superficie dal buio la luce una scrittrice italiana Anna Maria Ortese diceva a proposito del cinema ma allora esiste un mondo dove incontro all'ombra può venire la luce? Questo è il cinema di Regina Pessoa. Questa enorme eh, fatica che è di un gigante perché è di un poeta. E, è di un poeta e infatti come dire, Regina ci introduce al nostro esserci al mondo. Esserci perché ne capta la fatica, il dolore, ma anche l'indubitabile poesia. Una poesia che è anche nelle nostre vite banali, banali, quotidiane. E questo apparenta moltissimo a una cifra poetica, riconoscibile, e che quindi ci eh, designa, e soprattutto il cinema di Regina Pessoa, oltre ad essere una grande opera filmica, è una grande ode alla libertà. Thank as well to Matilde for his generous words. Um, uh, it's hard to believe that she's talking about me. <laughs> and that I'm this person. Um, I'm very flattered. Thank you. I mostly use my own experiences uh, to, uh, on my films. I mean, uh, simple stories about ordinary people. That's why my first film is about the a little girl that is afraid of the dark because I thought, uh, well, it's my first film. Uh, when I was a kid, I was very afraid of the dark. And this is uh, a good um, drama uh, line. And I remember as well something that Avi have told me, a very uh, useful hint when I was Uh, lost in finding ideas, he told me, uh, don't, don't lose yourself too much. Just think about something that uh, is strong for you, that really means something for you, and if you feel it, your images will tell it, and uh, other people that will see these images will feel it too. The film This first film went well. I made the, the, the one that is uh, exhibition about, Tragic Story with Happy Ending. I was encouraged by uh, picking these uh, own experiences and uh, it came out this second film, Tragic Story with Happy Ending. And uh, when I finished it, uh, I felt that something was missing to uh, be in peace with myself. I mean, to, we are, uh, come to a certain age that we have to uh, be in peace with our own childhood. When we are young kids and then young people, we have dreams. And when some, a moment comes and we are no longer ch children nor uh, young people, we are adults and we uh, see back and we a lot of dreams that we have when we were young we didn't manage to realize them and uh, maybe a certain um, frustration comes out but somehow we have to accept ourselves because we cannot go back to do a short film takes very long uh, our films take from two years to seven years to do And uh, after such a long period of working on the same subject, it's, uh, it's nice to do different things, to change, to open to different things. And if I have made direction of some films, now I'm making production of other films. I also work as a, a, a teacher. I work with kids. I also have been using different animation techniques some drawings, some cutouts, some sand animation, uh, and this is also a process of changing. One of my films were one of the first to be supported was The Outlaws, the one where I met Regina. And that means that this, this film makes the difference bet between a long period of no short films in Portugal and the beginning of a new period where films were supported. Even if we have 
money from government to produce films. We have always two options, to do the films with the money that we have, or to do the films that we want to do. That's a slightly different thing. Because the way we like to do the films, to take seven, five to seven years to do a short film, there is not money to pay that. When I finished a tragic story, uh, I was empty. <laughs> uh, uh, I was fragile, uh, of course. We give uh, uh, all we have. Um, uh, the, when we make a film, there are uh, several steps. At the beginning, it's the creativity. We have to have an idea, uh, we have to dream about it, we have to uh, increase this creativity. But when we uh, have the budget and uh, the production starts, we just have to do it. And uh, it's a more a mechanical thing. And uh, it's there that the motivation is important and don't uh, lose the focus on the, what we want to do. When she's working, she's working so hard. It's, I, don't, I don't know how she can do it. She's been working for two years, sleeping four hours a day, working 16 hours a day. And I, I don't know how she handles. And then when she gets a film done, then she's totally <laughs> exhausted. Uh, I, don't, I don't know how she can do it. Really don't. Alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> it's a joke, it's a joke. <laughs>